Hey everybody. Um, I want to talk about. I've been watching astrophysics and learning all about. It, okay, I think they're missing the biggest point, right? The gravity they say that connects atoms is their vibration. They're on the same sequence, so they attract each other. Okay, theoretically. And then, so now let's get into dark matter. Okay, dark matter is like a neutral, so it has no vibration which means it cannot attract nor um expel anything to or from it it has no value it's just neutral it's not positive it's not negative like an atom has so it's just that's why it's called dark matter it can't be measured because everything is measured by vibrations and vibrations are actually what the gravitational waves are gravitational force is the vibration of something. That's why the Earth puts out electric waves without us having to do anything. Like you can get online, you can look up how to um, get Earth from the ground or electric from the ground. It's it's really not that complicated when you think about it. It's just like understand. Think of magnets, okay? The atoms are magnets, right? You have a negative. It has no magnetic force, no vibration. So it cannot attract, it cannot expel. It's just there. So like, for example, let's say you have two magnets, right? Because you know the positive and the negative connect. The same positive, two positives retract, two negatives retract. So say, like I said, it has no vibration. So you put a piece of cardboard in between them. It has no interaction between the two. But at the same time, the magnets hold it together and keep it in place. That's pretty much the definition of dark matter, is that it has, it's neutral. It has no positive, no negative. It has no vibration. Have a blessed day, everybody.